gosh, you guys. So I just found decorative glass knobs. These are literally so cute. Hey guys and welcome back to my channel so in today's video we are home decor shopping at the dollar store and yes you can actually home decor shop at the dollar store for only a dollar and 25 cents and you can also create diy projects you know from the dollar stores so i feel like this would be a lot of fun because right now we are renting a townhouse in sunny south florida until we get our dream home so definitely stay tuned for you know us buying our dream home here in sunny south florida we want to live here forever so yeah we are going to deck out the townhouse and you know what whenever you're renting why not just buy you know cheap products at the dollar store and see what you can do to make your space even better usually I go to five below but I feel like switching it up and showing you guys what this dollar store location literally has to offer like there's door knobs that you can spray paint I mean there is so much in here that we definitely have to scope out so hopefully I can find goodies and hopefully no one bought everything out that sometimes happens when I try to make videos like this but if you guys want to see more you know Dollar Tree home decor shopping videos in the future don't forget to like comment and share this one after this video if you did enjoy it if you are new this channel is all about shopping so I post everyday shopping videos but now I'm trying to spice things up and give you guys you know different ideas in our favorite stores so like I said if you want more variety instead of just like walking through the store and buying stuff you want to see like you know home decor shopping and all of that then please don't forget to like comment and share it just tells me to keep making these type of videos it would literally mean so much to me but one more thing Thing. you guys probably noticed in the beginning of the video that I went to Dunkin Donuts so my coffee is actually melted because I went shopping at the biggest thrift store and let me tell you guys something it was literally so much fun I spent over two hours in there because it was that big so yeah I'll put a link down below if you guys missed yesterday's video but yeah let's go ahead and go into this dollar store I'm super excited and actually one more thing there's also a giveaway going on so if you guys want to enter to win a store gift card of your choice then don't forget to check out the box down below the instructions are super easy and every first of the month there's going to be a giveaway winner and a new giveaway announcement so definitely stay tuned because the first is literally around the corner but yeah i'm very very excited like i said to see what i can find and hopefully it looks really good in our place like i said there's going to be a dollar tree haul at the end of this video showing you like what i came up with so yeah very exciting but i can't forget to grab my coffee i need to drink the rest of it even though it's like melted but yeah let me go ahead and flip the camera, show you guys the scenery here in sunny South Florida. Oh my gosh, you guys, so they literally have summer beach decor out, like what? And we live in sunny South Florida, so of course we are going to go crazy in this section right now, like what? So I'm very interested in these wood beak garlands, like usually at TJ Maxx and Marshalls, these are at least $10, so I'm literally obsessing. And all you have to do is like place this on the entertainment center. You can also like paint this to make it really cute, like a light blue color, or even mint green coral, whatever you want. There's even boat ones, oh my gosh, so I definitely like the anchor ones the most so i'm going to get two of these for the entertainment center so if you guys want to see how these look then definitely keep on watching So I have the two beads in the basket, but look at these, you guys. Really nice to add to the entertainment center as well. So these are called the jute balls. They only have two of these here. Like obviously I need to get the last two. I still can't believe I'm scoring over and over again. So you can also paint these wooden pieces. This one says, sun, take me to the ocean. I love that. The other one says, the sand and me with the starfish. Oh my gosh, I love the whale on the top too. But the best pieces are definitely the ones that say beach. How cute. So I really want something over like the oven, if that makes sense. So I will show you guys what I'm talking about. But I like this gray color so pretty. I wish they had other colors. So they actually just have like a wooden piece piece but we are going with a modern theme so I feel like maybe I should go with the gray one and it's the last one too so really exciting find 
And you guys, there's even stickers. How cute are these? Wander by the sea, should you ever want to find me. From sea to shining sea, the whale, the mermaid, ocean sees the day. Wish upon a starfish, mini mermaid. These are so cute and the brush set, so you get two pieces. But look at this, you guys. They actually have a starfish and also an anchor. Like these are huge. Hopefully you guys can tell on the camera. There's even like these mini chalkboards. Oh my gosh, with the shells on it. And here are some anchors. Oh my gosh, DIY pens. Let me know what you guys are going to use these for us so there's mermaids there's even like shells again little fish whales so these are the coastal icons and there's more whales oh my gosh i love these look at this one it says sea there's like pen boards you can put in your office i kind of like this if I get like some pens, what do you guys think? There's even like an octopus up there, more chalkboard with the shells. Oh my gosh, look at this one. So cute. Not sure where I put this, but this is really nice for the office. You know, you can pin like your notes. I really like this idea. So the next thing that I noticed are these like mini pillows. They actually have a seahorse one. This one has anchors. They even have colorful pens with the seahorses, the colorful boat. And these are the flexible stencils. So they have a mermaid with a starfish. Up here it says from sea to shining. Another cute one. Oh my gosh, look at this scent. I love these starfish clips. Oh my gosh, I'm literally obsessing. And you guys, I just found a white beach sign. Like I definitely need this one over the blue one. It would definitely pop in the kitchen like what okay so i just switched them out but let's go ahead and move on look at this bin it's so beachy not sure what i would use this for but you can definitely turn this into a pot for a plant you know and look at these a dish drying mat but it's super tiny i like the really big ones and here are some tablecloths how cute if you're throwing a party and these are so adorable oh my gosh i'm literally obsessing and yes i love this candle holder it's so cute don't you guys love it too they actually have smaller bins down here if you guys don't care about like the bigger ones so please let me know which one is your favorite but this one has starfish on it too it's so cute and there's even craft fabric honestly i'm not that you know creative but i have to say they have blue and white there's even decorative mesh let me know your diy projects that you guys plan on doing and look at this tray it's so cute to match like the you know cups and everything and what do we have here oh my gosh how cute i love the shade of Blue. it's so adorable and you guys are going to love like these vases oh my gosh but first let's go ahead and check out you know the decor so the one down here says happiness is easy at the beach the other one says home is where the waves crash with the palm trees up here it says meet me at seaside home love you seize the day with the glitter salty and happy beach vibes only these are actually really really nice if you have you know a pool outside in your backyard beach vibes only oh my gosh seize the day again life is better at the beach which is so true and they have these smaller pieces but look at the fish and they actually have more of these over here here but i think i just need one of each right now i love these though in the red anchor you can't go wrong so cute in like the garage or something all things grow with love plant seeds of happiness kindness and love so cute in the front porch or even in the backyard two less fish in the sea gone to the beach love you to the beach and back you are my anchor you guys probably remember this one last year beach days are the best days that is so true i like this one too but honestly i don't have space for this decor but i'll the way down here they have these really cute key hooks so i really want to get one of these because we definitely need more hooks but this one is kind of crooked let's go ahead and find one that is perfect right this one is actually really really nice and really easy to hang so i will go with it and let's go ahead and see what else they have down here. So smaller pieces, this one says it's a beach thing. The other one says on beach time, a mermaid lives here, surfs sun and sand. Mermaids have more fun, just beachy. And I can't forget to show you guys like these really cute vases. So they have dark blue, light blue. You can also put like plants in here, like small ones. And I love the clear vases, honestly my favorite. And I just realized that this one has a top to it. How cute literally obsessing but do you guys like this one definitely let me know and here's the next one so it's blue with a seashell on the top so really cute but you guys are going to love the mint green one so beachy looking and so nice like in the bathroom oh my gosh they look amazing honestly it doesn't look like a dollar and 25 cents so what a deal 
So I just made it to another section full of decor, but some of these are actually for if you're throwing a party. So they have confetti for the table, novelty glasses, of course, and look at these inflatable decor. That is so awesome for only $1.25. And these are actually coasters. That is the cutest thing ever. So they have a pink and orange pineapple, also a leaf, which is so Florida. And here are some wall decor. Oh my gosh, an LED paper lantern. How cute in the backyard. And here are some more banners. So you can definitely definitely throw a summer party and look at this one fishing net decor you can definitely make this so cute I really want to bring this home not sure what I'm going to you know put on it yet but I feel like I could definitely use this net decor and get one of those like pens and make something really really cute and I think if I clip this on the net it will look cute so like I said we will see what I end up doing but let's go ahead and move on. So it looks like they have cups, plates for your party. And look at this one. So cute with the popsicles. And it says sweet summer. There's cups. I love this one the most, you guys. So you can definitely make a really pretty party. And this is literally my favorite flower. So the island flowers. Look at this one. Summer vibes. Oh my gosh. The pineapple plates are everything. But look at this one. A photo backdrop. And I just realized they have a green net. So I remember a while back, like actually five years ago, I I got one of these fishing net decors like the big ones from Kirkland so I want to recreate it but look at this one welcome to paradise it's five o'clock somewhere which is so true so if you guys see anything throughout the video don't forget to let me know So I found more decor over here, you guys. I love how it's spread out throughout the store. So this one says too much Monday, not enough coffee. That is so true. Less is more unless it's coffee. That is so true as well. Down here, they have an XOXO piece and a treat fund. But look at this one, you guys, a pink bird. There's even a blue one. If you guys didn't care about the clear candle holder, they also have a dark blue one. So that is amazing. But let's go ahead and check out the other side. So they have gnomes. And on this side, how cute are the crosses? And look at these white candle holders they even have the colors pink and brown down there and these are so pretty too and very colorful so you guys won't believe this they actually got in new decorative glass knobs so i went over these in my previous video i told you guys that you can actually spray paint these and they're only a dollar and 25 cents each obviously cheaper than going to lowe's for like eight bucks a piece especially for similar ones so i love the fact that they got in blue ones even the diamond looking ones which are literally so cute i went to home goods and i got like six of them for ten dollars so what a deal here but i love the pink clear ones are so cute but this one is beautiful that shade of blue you know for the beach look i feel like i should switch out the knobs on my dresser for these they're so cute but they also have the bigger diamond ones but there's only one of these left so maybe i should go with these they're so cute So I decided to go ahead and get four of these for the nightstands because I want to see how these are going to look on the nightstands before I go in and replace the dresser ones because honestly it takes a minute but I just want to show you guys how these are going to look because they're so cute and so nice for that beachy look. And look what else I just found you guys. They actually have more candle holders, clear pot. This one says give thanks and be grateful. Look at the flower ones. Oh my gosh the candle holders are so cute. Especially this one with the leaves. Mother like other mom with the flowers do you guys see anything over here whenever it comes to candle holders i just have to know but honestly the highlight of the shopping spree definitely has to be the decorative glass knobs like what so I decided to go ahead and get this one right here. So it's white and gray. I definitely need another hook right before we go into the garage. So I feel like this one is going to look a lot better than this one because honestly it looks pretty cheap, you know? So let's go ahead and put this back. But look what else I just found, you guys. So the LED tea light candles. This one turns red, purple, and green. That is awesome. So I really want to put this in the anchor holder, like in this holder right here. So hopefully it looks 
really, really good. But I want it to glow blue in the bedroom. How cute would that look? So if you guys think I'm scoring already for the house, then definitely give this one a really big thumbs up for me. And don't forget to leave a comment down below. But I'm very excited to go home and see how everything is going to look in the house. I think it's going to look amazing. Like I said, we will see. But wow, the hooks are so cute. And so is the LED tea light candles. Like, let's cross our fingers that everything works out for me. But I can't forget to show you guys a closer look of the other colors. So everyone is picking up the white and gray ones, but not the like bronze and brown. There's even like teal and dark blue, which is really cute. But here are these symbol hooks if you guys need two of them. You can also spray paint these if you don't care about the colors. So it's like a dark brown color. So really nice still. So for the fishing net, I feel like I definitely need to add some shells to it. So they have like white shells, different colored ones, which are really nice. Honestly, I should go to the beach and pick them out myself. That would be a lot of fun and add it to the fishing net. But if you guys don't live near the beach, just know they have a bunch of these here. But I need smaller shells for that fishing net, you know. And there's even like stone. Look at these, you guys, the clear beads. I love the green ones. There's even blue. How cute. Color changing LED candle light. So I just made it to another side, you guys, full of wall hooks. So this one says Simply Bless, it's white and black, and down here they have wall decals, which is literally so exciting. So you can definitely, you know, upgrade your space. You only get one for $1.25, so keep that in mind. They have teal and silver. This one is really pretty, so gray and silver. The marble print, oh my gosh, you can definitely transform your space. There's even gold, white and silver again. Look at this one down here. And let me tell you guys something in person, it looks really, really good. Like on Honestly, I'm shocked, but we are renting, so I don't feel like, you know, decking it out like that. But look at this butterfly one. Oh my gosh. And it says these aren't for the wall. It's for DIY projects. So let me know what you guys plan on doing with these pieces, but really awesome find. And of course, they have wall creations over here. So really cute. I love the butterfly ones. They have like red and orange, blue and white, suns. Look at this one with the hearts. So cute. This one says sassy since birth. I love the boho looking jumbo stickers oh my gosh you guys how cute would this be and it says they are removable so that's pretty awesome i'm just not sure where i'd put this I didn't think about putting stickers on the wall. This one is pretty cute. More jumbo stickers. These are really cute. Oh my gosh, I love the butterflies. There's roses, a map for an office, rainbows again. Do you guys see anything? More decor pieces over here. So you guys are going to love this. Wi-Fi, sweet Wi-Fi password is. So you actually hang this up, but I wish you could just like sit it down. Then I would definitely have a spot for it. So that's pretty sad. And the next one says be our guest Wi-Fi password. And you guys look at these mirrors. So you can definitely spray paint it and scatter this in a small space. And this one is new. So it's gold. It's really cute. Do you guys have a spot for these mirrors? Don't forget to let me know. And down here it says pretending to work. I wish they had a pink one to match like my gaming setup. And down here they have a jewelry holder. And look over here, you guys. Make today great. Home sweet home. These are so cute. I like these wall hooks too. But that one is more simple, you know. So I'm probably just going to stick with that one. And look up here. So they have pieces if you're getting married. And look at these flowers. Oh my gosh. So nice in a small space as well but like always don't forget to leave a comment down below More decor pieces over here, you guys. Like, literally insane. So this coffee is making me awesome. That is so cute. The next one says, stay focused. You definitely have to dig. And look at this one. Pretty much like coffee pieces and like these canvases. Love you to the beach and back. I love that saying. You are magical. Brush sets randomly. A house full of love. They have the mirrors again. Honestly, I don't see anything that is really standing out to me over here besides like these circular mirrors, which are really nice to scatter in a small space especially if you spray paint it the color that you really want. Believe in magic. So I just made it to another section full of jars. So how cute are these? So they have red and black, white and black, and up here they have like reddish pink, the clear ones, and down here they have dark blue and purple.
And yes, you guys, I just found garlands. These are so cute. Wow. You can definitely spice up your space with these. They even have like the island flowers. Oh my gosh. I love these. They're so pretty. There's only one pink one left. I need to find a spot for these. They're so cute. Honestly, I'm probably going to put this above my mirror. I think that would look really cute. Like I said, we will see. I need to bring those home. And of course, they have many plants down here, but we have seen these before, to be honest. And they literally have every single flower at this Dollar Tree location. So if you're looking for a specific one, then you're probably in luck. They even have the bigger ones. How adorable. I have to know if you guys see anything at all. Honestly, I was hoping to find like the beach stems, but it looks like they don't have it here. I guess I could use one of these because I recently got a really cute jar. So they have yellow, blue, and I just realized these are butterflies that is so cute i wonder which one i should get i probably should go with the whitish red one because we are going with a modern theme i feel like it would definitely stand out in the kitchen i can't wait to show you guys what i'm talking about these are butterflies too oh my gosh but the blue one is really cute but then i look over here and i found a really cute set but i wish they sold the grass like individually without the butterflies you know so i just found the one you guys hopefully it looks amazing in the jar and i can always like trim the bottom if it looks funny but most of these were bent so it was really really hard to find the whitish red one so i guess i'm out of luck actually no i'm wrong i just found one that isn't bent and it's white and red so this one is definitely going to look a lot better versus like the blue one but then again the blue one has like straighter stems do you guys see the dilemma i'm in or maybe i should go with the blue one because beachy colors right So I got the goodies, you guys, and it's actually raining. So let's go ahead and run to the car. Oh my goodness. So we just made it to the car, you guys, and it's literally pouring outside, but the sun is out too. So hopefully I didn't break my camera just now. I don't think I did. But anyways, I got the goodies this bent on the way to the car because I started freaking out because it started raining harder. But yeah, if you guys want to see how all of these goodies look in, you know, our beach townhouse, I like to call it a beach cottage, then definitely keep on watching. But you can definitely transform something that you're renting for cheap. And then once you get the house, then obviously you can go big and buy you know really nice quality stuff but i feel like when you're renting you shouldn't spend too much until you buy your dream home because you never know like how the house is going to be and what kind of theme you really want to go with so for the meantime if you guys want to make your place feel more at home then definitely go to the dollar store and buy below and mix everything together you will be surprised on how amazing your house looks but you know what it's finally time to head home and i'll talk to you guys more once i get there so I have two bags full of stuff, you guys, and here's the first item that I want to put somewhere in the house. So I think I'm going to put this above the mirror to make it really cute and tropical looking in the bedroom because our bedroom is that beach and modern theme. So I feel like this one is definitely going to add a lot. So like I said, they had other colors. This was actually the last one and I think it's really, really cute. Honestly, it's the only pink thing in the bedroom. So I guess it's fine during the spring and summertime, right? So let's go ahead and see how this one is going to look on top of the mirror. Here. So I'm not sure if you guys can tell, but it's actually the next day and this literally looks amazing over this white mirror that I got from Ikea. So my husband actually painted this with chalk paint and it looks really, really good. Like, wow, you guys, honestly, 10 out of 10 for only $1.25. It definitely transformed like this little small space. I just have to know your thoughts. Oh my gosh, I love it so much. Don't forget to comment down below your thoughts. I mean, it's so cute. And the other colors will look amazing on here as well. Sorry, you guys, you probably 
notice like where I set my camera whenever I was doing like the mirror. I forgot to get my tripod, but when you're a YouTuber, you do funny stuff like this. But yeah, this is so cute. I love it. So moving on to the next plan, you guys. Honestly, I have a vase in the kitchen where I want to put this in, but I just realized that this part is bent. Actually, I remember why it was raining and I bent it. So we are going to make this work in a minute, but let's go ahead and focus on, you know, the bedroom first before we move on. So the next thing that I got for the bedroom is the product right here. So it's actually the beachy, you know, like candle holder. So I decided to get this little jar so I can put these LED tea lights in here. I think it's going to look so cute. So let's see how this looks. And I love turning on lights at night, so we'll see see if this flows. So I'm going to sit you guys down and then we can finally do this little DIY project. When I do DIY, I just grab one thing and grab another thing and put it together. I don't like do the glue and all of that stuff. Maybe in the future if I get really crafty, but I'm not the most craftiest person in the world. But yeah, these are the LED tea light candles once again. Apparently it claims to be good for 60 hours. So I don't know how true that is. I mean, it's only a dollar. I'm not expecting much. As long as it lights up, I think it's going to be a really Really cute piece for only you know almost three bucks for these two so let's go ahead and open this one up I lost a diamond I didn't realize that these were loose for some reason I thought there was like strings so I guess all you have to do is put this little tea light right in the middle Actually, I think I need to turn this on. And it says it's waterproof, so you can actually put this outside. Rotate the base counterclockwise until it opens. Remove the white insert covering the battery and reattach the base. Twist to turn the tea light on and off. That's pretty simple. I am literally breaking everything. So I finally put it back together, you guys, and this one changes colors on its own. So it goes from green to blue to red. So you can't control it. That's the only downside, but you know what? That makes it very fun, right? So there's a problem, you guys. It won't stay in the middle because it does have like a little hill right there. But let's go ahead and pour like these diamonds inside. And obviously we need to turn off the lamp. And let's go ahead and put the curtain like this so it gets kind of dark so you guys can see how it looks better at night. I should have got two of these, like the diamonds for fillers, but I think it's really, really pretty at night. What do you guys think? And actually, I just realized it turns other colors besides red, blue. Obviously, I'm not going to keep it on, you know, the Bath & Potty Works candle holder. Like, this is supposed to go in your bathroom whenever you're taking a bath or even like a small space in your bedroom, like on the nightstand, on the entertainment dresser. So, you know what? I'm going to put this on my side in the bedroom. This is actually my husband's side, but yeah, I'm really, really happy how this turned out. Obviously, I need to get more fillers like the diamond one, but overall, I'm actually very impressed with it. I'm just going to put it right here for right now. And let's turn off the lamp so you guys can see it better. So yeah, it just looks like that whenever I step back. I think it's really, really pretty and it definitely adds a little bit of light at night. It's so calming, honestly. And I love the different colors like blue to purple to pink. So 100% yes if you guys want this one. So it's finally time to go downstairs because I have more stuff put around the house and I think I want to start off in the kitchen. So I will meet you guys downstairs. So here's the kitchen, you guys, like my coffee area. I can't wait to build our home and have like an actual coffee area separate from the kitchen. If you guys know what I'm talking about, you probably have a house like that, but I love how this looks in the vase, you guys. I definitely needed to add more to it. Obviously, I need to take off the tag and everything. I just wanted to make sure it would actually work with this vase, but yeah, it looks really, really pretty. I love it. And the blue, you know, butterfly flowers are super cute on there. I just wish they had 
had you know the white and red one it would have looked a lot better but you know what that's okay I can always get that one and add to it but here is like real quickly my new Nespresso if you guys are interested I'll put a link down below so it makes like macchiatos espressos and I have a Nespresso holder which I've had for many many years and I recently got new coffee mugs and I've had this marble print holder for a while and you guys probably remember when we first moved here I got the coffee sugar and tea holders and I don't use the coffee holder anymore but I guess I could I could put like the mini pods in there but anyways I really love this definitely let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below so beautiful and you guys probably remember that I got these coffee mugs from TJ Maxx and Marshalls. I believe this one was $6 and the other one is actually priced at, I think it was a little bit more for eight bucks. So I highly recommend getting, you know, modern boho coffee mugs from there. Actually, it says $4. It takes a long time for these stickers to come off. Sometimes I forget to do it and I run it through the dishwasher and it comes off on its own. But yeah, that is pretty much like my coffee setup. So once again, link will be down below for these two right here. And here's the next piece, you guys. So I specifically went to Hobby Lobby looking for this size that says beach and I can't believe I found it at the dollar store honestly just blew me away so I really want to put it above you know the oven. You guys, this literally looks amazing above the oven. So I got another piece from Hobby Lobby, but it was way too big for this space. So I'm very, very happy how this turned out. I think it looks amazing and it looks really nice next to my coffee machine and everything. So what do you guys think? Definitely let me know. But once again, I'm very, very happy for only $1.25. So it's finally time to move on to the living room, you guys. And the girls and my husband just got done playing the new game, Nintendo Switch Sports. And I haven't tried it out yet, but I can't wait. So let's go ahead and see if I can make these pieces add a lot more to the living room. I know these pieces are going to look really nice in the living room. I'm just not sure exactly where I want to put them. I might put them, you know, right next to these baskets or on the bookshelf. I feel like there's a lot over there, but let's go ahead and see if I can make it work on the entertainment center. So I found a spot for them, you guys, right in the middle. And I think it looks amazing with the five below baskets that I got recently. So if you guys are going for, you know, that boho beach look, then I feel like you should definitely go for these rope decor for only $1.25. But what do you guys think for the price point? I'm sorry about the lighting. It's getting dark outside. I think it's about to rain here in sunny South Florida. But yeah, I think it looks really, really good. Don't forget to let me know your thoughts in the comment section down below. But it's starting to feel more and more beachy in here. So let's go ahead and move on to the next piece. So of course I had to get, you know, these little garland things. What are they called? Wood beads garland. So usually people put this on their entertainment center, like on the top or on a bookshelf or even on a coffee table. So let's go ahead and see where I'm going to put this. Honestly, not sure. I just bought these and hope for the best. And here's the end result, you guys. I think it looks really nice on a bookshelf. If you guys don't want to hang this up, if you do, then you definitely have to buy a bunch of them so it's long enough to actually hang on the wall. But I think it's really nice to add to a bookshelf, an entertainment center, or like, you know, a really small shelf somewhere. So let me know your thoughts. And obviously you can paint this however you want or spray paint it. I'm going to keep it that whitish cream color because it flows with our theme. So that's why I had to get it. And I think it definitely added a lot to this bookshelf. Very happy with the end result, like always. So moving on to the key holder, you guys. This one is super cute because it's white and gray. It's going to match our theme. And we just need one hook, like right next to the garage door. So let's go ahead and put this up.
I want you guys to see the differences, so I'm going to replace the nightstand ones, and if I like it enough, then I'll go back to the dollar store and get the ones for the dresser, but I got these from Home Goods. You get a pack of six for $10, so we will see how these look for $1.25. Let me go ahead and step back so you guys can see like the bigger picture. So yes, the blue knobs actually look really pretty for that beach theme, but they're flowers. I wish it was like a seahorse or something or even like a starfish. It would have looked way better in our bedroom for that modern beachy look. So you know what? I'm going to keep the diamond ones until I find the perfect knob for this room. I probably have to go to Hobby Lobby, but I'm very happy that I found, you know, a cheap alternative, especially for those of you that want to update your knobs without spending a fortune somewhere else so yeah just let me know your thoughts and obviously I'm going to put back the diamond one once I'm done with this video but I will save these for whenever we buy a house and I want to put this like in a random bathroom or something I mean in a bathroom how cute would those look so yeah I just love the diamond ones it looks so classy in here so like I said just let me know your thoughts and actually the blue glass ones look amazing with you know this little candle thing it's really really cute so yeah just let me know and I'm more than likely going to donate everything Thing that you see in this place because I just want a fresh start when we get that house like I'm going to spend a lot of money on you know really nice furniture I mean I did get that really nice coffee table that one is definitely coming with us like the stuff I did spend a lot of money on of course will transfer to the new home but like five low pieces and all of that is definitely going to be donated or I will sell maybe on Poshmark I don't know I feel like just donating because these pieces aren't very expensive but I mean look how nice it looks for 10 bucks so yeah don't be afraid to just go cheap whenever you're renting and just save up for the big stuff you know so that's just my advice for you guys but anyways that is pretty much it for this video if you guys want to see more diy home decor shopping videos at different stores don't forget to give this one a really big thumbs up for me don't forget to leave a comment down below and of course share so we can reach 1 million subscribers together but i hope that you guys have a wonderful day and i'll see you guys in tomorrow's video